Hello everyone, it's Lucas from Fox Tech, and at this time we take a look at the iPad and the topic is how you can go ahead and change your iMessage from email to phone number. Now, to explain it very quickly, you can use either your email address or a phone number to communicate with others using iMessage. So it's up to you to decide and it's up to other people that you speak to to decide for themselves. So it, it is a little bit different. So for your own, in case you want to appear as, at, either as a phone number or as email, to change it for yourself, you need to open up the settings like that and just scroll down to find the messages. So tap on messages like this. And there is an option under the iMessage right here. So you can go ahead and disable iMessage altogether or enable it depending on how you have it set up. But there's the option to click on send and receive. And there is the ability to, to choose if you wanna have the phone number there or email address. So for me, I have the option and both of the options are selected. So I can use both, but you can, for example, uncheck the email and it will only, only use the phone number. And start new conversations with, you can also choose which one you wanna uh, be seen on other people's phones. So it can, again, be either a phone number or the email address. So that's how it works. This is for your view or how you view your, um, how you basically start text. So it's only like regarding you, you as a person. So in, in case you have some other people which are calling you or which are contacting you on iMessage and you don't want to see the email at the top and they, the other side, wants to keep their email there, you can basically save them as a contact. So you just go to your contacts, create a new one, or go to the messages and save that contact in your contacts list and you can name them whatever you want. And then their name is gonna show up there. So it's very cool. It's very a nice way how you can go ahead and just like make sure you don't see the email there. So hopefully I explained to you properly how it works and how you can go ahead and use it. What's the distinction between the phone number and email? So if you found this video useful, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe down below, and also check out other content on the Fox Tech YouTube channel, as well as the Fox Tech educational platform, which is linked below for free and in the description, of course. So go ahead and join that and I'll wait for you inside. Thanks all for watching. See you guys later.